Hello and welcome back to another video on my channel. This is going to be the very best tip that I'm going to be giving out all year. I'm going to be showing you guys around the defense that's been very popular among the competitive community at least. And it's also going to impact your game drastically. Now on defense, this is going to be around defense video obviously as I just said. We're going to be coming out in the 2 4 5 uh, uh, defense. I don't know which playbook I'm in right now, but I'm going to put a list out uh, right there of all the playbooks that has this formation. And we're going to call uh, the play bench blitz, not bench blitz 3. Now, this is not the run, a run defense that I've personally left up. This is a run defense that's gained popularity among the competitive community and pretty much every tip youtuber has made a video about it and on the off chance you have not seen this defense yet i want to bring it to you guys I, I feel like even though i'm using somebody else's content i don't think that i would be doing my job quote unquote job correctly if i didn't show it to you guys now this is how the play looks uh bench splits three on defense now first thing is we're going to press i'm going to do the setup first and then i'm going to explain the button layouts for you guys press blitz all linebackers uh, slant your D-line inside and then move your guy here and hover. Now I'm going to be running stretch out of iPhone tight, one of the most popular runs. And we're going to see what happens. I'm going to snap the ball. And you see how we just get in instantly and the opponent, opposing quarterback has no chance to end the ball. Now let's talk about the setup with the buttons. We're going to press, which is triangle, and then the left stick down. We're going to blitz our linebackers, which is right on the D-pad, and then uh, the right stick down, which blitzes all of these linebackers. Then we're going to slant inside, which is left on the D-pad, and right stick down. You can also keep it contained. No, I don't want to keep it contained, but you can. And then hover right here. Now, if we run, if we run, uh, if we run this, we actually, you actually can see we can be causing a fumble there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Couldn't have worked out better now. One more time. Press. Let's all linebacker slant inside. And that's the whole defense. Just move up here. There are some. Jeez. Um, there are some runs that gash this run defense. And if your opponent knows them, then you just have to switch run defense. It's, then it's just on you to know that you're not going to have success with that. But again, against I tight, it's at least against I tight. I'm, I haven't left this against many other runs. This is going to absolutely blow shit up okay now if your opponent figures out a way to fi figures out which runs speed this go into edge blitz out of three four odd and yeah i'm going to show you a run defense that also works it doesn't work quite as well but it's still an amazing run defense now we're going to pinch our line which is left on the d-pad down on left stick we're going to spread our linebackers right on the d-pad up on the left stick we're going to blitz all linebackers. We're going to go right on the D-pad, down on the right stick. It looks like that. And we're going to keep the chain, which is R L1 R1 or LB RB. And we have this, and then we're going to move our safety down right here. And if they want to run this, you see how we just get in. Okay, so that's another way of playing run defense. But this is not what this video is about. This video is about the best run defense in the game right now, which is this Nickel 2 for 5 odd. Once again, this can be found in many, many different playbooks. Bench Blitz 3, we're going to... Let's run something other than that. From slot, Stretch Alert Bubble. Um, this might actually be a run that gashes this. I'm not sure, actually. We'll see. Um, Okay. So, we just found a run that absolutely gashes this. Okay. So... Remember that, guys. It's not the perfect run defense. Let's try it again. Yeah, okay. So we're not getting in at all. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Wait a minute. I'm actually going to try something, okay? Because I just watched a video of K-Mac doing this, and he said that runs where you have RPO blocking, so like RPO under center runs, they get pretty good blocking. We'll I'll see how that if that's true. Let's go stretch our X look excuse me. It's, my nose is itching. Set up the run defense. And if this works, then yeah. Run defense is set up. We got RPO blocking or we should have it. 
And yeah, so you see, this gashes this defense. Okay. What we just learned against I tight against any run that's not an RPO, this is great. This is a great run defense. But if your opponents, if your opponent knows that and he's running inside uh, RPOs, then of course you're going to be in trouble. Let's try this just one last time against a run that's not an RPO. And yeah. I mean, it didn't get the thing that we wanted, but it still worked. It still worked. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying out a couple of things right now. So, weak. Actually, this should work. We snap the ball. And we're getting in free. Okay. To sum up this video, it's not good against RPOs, but it's great against anything that's not an RPO. Okay. Um, I've said okay way, way too many times this video. I'm sorry, guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then hit the like button, obviously. And if you really, really enjoyed it, then I would really appreciate it if you hit the sub button to my channel to subscribe, obviously. I'll see you in the next one. Make sure to pop these runners because now there's no reason for you to not absolutely destroy every runner you're facing. I'm out. See you in the next one. Peace out.